Good morning, West Fargo, and welcome to the September 9th edition of the Packer News. I'm Kaylee Stoka. And I'm Courtney Everson. Here are today's headlines. Students interested in the emergency medical services should check out FMA Explorer's post to observe and participate with successful paramedics. The first orientation meeting is Monday, October 5th at 6 p.m. in the FM Ambulance Service in Fargo. The cost is $50. Stop in the Career Center for more information. Ludacris, B.O.B., Hopson, Futuristic, Big Reno, and more will be performing live in Fargo at the Newman Outdoor Field Friday, September 9th in the first annual JCI Music Festival. Doors open at 3 p.m. and the show starts at 5. This is an all-ages show and the portion of the proceeds go to the American Cancer Society. The school's literary magazine, X Premier, will be holding an informational meeting about how to get involved in this creative activity. The literary magazine publishes photography, poetry, short stories, song lyrics, photo illustrations, artwork, sculpture, or anything of a creative nature. We will be meeting in 206H at 345 p.m. on Monday, September 12th. Please contact Ms. Hill if you have any questions. West Fargo Girls Basketball Open Gym for grades 9 through 12 is every Monday in September in the West Fargo High School Gym from 6.30 to 7.30 p.m. Please return your summer reversibles that you wore for Summer League to Coach Metcalf at Open Gym. JV football had a game on Tuesday playing against the Fargo South Bruins. Packers won 36-32, but it was great to see the football team back again. I can't wait to see what the season has in store for our Packers. The sixth annual Team Ian Run will be held Saturday at 9 a.m. This event raises money for families affected by pediatric cancer and for pediatric cancer research. This year, the proceeds from the events will be donated to the Children's Oncology Group. The one-mile run is $15 and the 5K run is $25. A t-shirt is included with each race. Registration is occurring during all three lunches today. Attention athletes, please be aware that locker rooms will be unavailable for your use during period 8. They will be opened at 3.30 when FIED classes are finished for the day. If you are free period 8, please remain in the comments or leave campus. As we all know, election day is on November 8th. Students were asked about who they would want to vote for. Here is Joe Lear with more on the story. Could you tell me who you prefer, Donald Trump or Hillary Clinton and why? Hillary Clinton because, frankly, yeah, she may have a screw loose, but I don't think it'd be enough to fill up a whole oil can like Donald Trump. Who do you prefer more, Hillary Clinton or Donald Trump and why? When you think about it, neither one is really qualified. Like, Clinton's got some good backing up, like, she's got some good uh, experience. And Trump, as a businessman, if he does his businessman kind of job, he treats the country like a business, he could keep it going. Could you tell me who you prefer, Donald Trump or Hillary Clinton, and why? Um, I prefer Trump because he is, like, he's definitely not a good person, but he's very honest. Like, I mean, sure, the idea of building a wall is ridiculous, but at least he's, like, straight up about it. Like, he's not going to lie about his goal. It's very interesting to know what opinions other people have on the elections. Yeah, I agree. The school's literary magazine, X Premier, will be holding an informational meeting about how to get involved in this creative activity. The literary magazine publishes photography, poetry, short stories, song lyrics, photo illustrations, artwork, sculpture, or anything of a creative nature. We will be meeting in 206H at 345 p.m. on Monday, September 12th. Please contact Ms. Hill if you have any questions. Student Congress will be having an informational meeting and its first practice Tuesday, September 13th. Come during 8th period or after school to 207H to learn more about this exciting activity. See Mr. Smeddy or Ms. Hill if you have any questions. Attention seniors, your photos for the 2017 yearbook is due December 3rd. Students, you can now drop it in the photo box in the office or email your photos to wfseniorphotos at gmail.com. And now a message from our student store. Uh, my name is uh, Michael Yule and uh, I work for the store here for DECA and we are selling uh, rivalry t-shirts from Shine vs. Packer then in two weeks. Um, you can come down and get a shirt. Uh, they're 10 bucks each. Uh, our largest is uh, XXL. So if you want some, come down or you can see anyone in DECA. We have a couple like Ava, Lindsay, Rihanna. If you know any of those names, you can go talk to them. But if you see me, just ask me about it and I'll get you one. Thanks so much for watching today's broadcast. I'm Kaylee Stoka. And I'm Courtney Everson. Have a great weekend, West Fargo.